Hi everybody, Keith is with Balance Body Mind here. I want to talk today about a single leg stance, why it's important to assess it. And particularly if you've been told to have uh, orthotics in because you have a flat feet, this might make you think again. When I want to assess someone in a single leg stance, we challenge it with the leg up. And the foot position actually gives a lot about what's going on from a stability perspective throughout the whole body. What we can tend to see is the toes gripping, which might tell us that there's a dysfunction going on in the neck. We can also see whether if the foot pronates or supinates, pronate flattens, supinate tends to roll out a bit more. In the pronated position, and a common thing that you'll tend to see is people who said they have flat feet and are given very expensive orthotics, which I think are a waste of time. We can change the foot position because the brain, which controls the muscles, is very plastic. We can change those muscles just by giving it the right input to change. Something like neurokinetic therapy is very effective for doing something like this. So if you do have flat feet, we can sometimes see there's a tightness in the perineals which can affect up at the outside of the body, it can affect the glutes, it can affect the QL which is responsible for stabilising us in the, in the frontal plane with other muscles and how we also affect our shoulder. So when we challenge this position and you do have flat feet and you've been told that you need to have orthotics, ask someone to check your single leg stance, see what's going on at the ankle, see what's going up in the upper body as well, and get someone who actually knows what they're talking about instead of saying that you need to have expensive orthotics done. It's a much cheaper way because you can learn how to do it yourself and you don't have to wear silly orthotics for the rest of your life.